Brenna, you're watching Be In My Life and Happy 2016! Okay, last day. Omedetou gozaimasu! Yay! <laughs> so, in New Year's in Japan, the first thing that usually comes to mind is Fukubukuro! Which are lucky bags or happy bags, you know, there's a lot of different ways to say it, but basically it is a grab bag that most stores, not only clothes stores, but cosmetics, um, accessories, socks, lots of places do it as a type of, you know, huge New Year sale, but kind of also to get rid of old stock. They start from about 5,000 yen to 10,000 yen or more for the clothing brands. Some are cheaper, like accessory shops will sell it for like a thousand yen or less. And uh, I wasn't actually going to buy any Fukubukuro this year because number one, Japanese sizes are tiny and most Fukubukuro only come in S, M, or free size. And I am not gonna fit in those. No way. But today, as I was walking around a uh, HEP5 in Osaka, I managed to chance upon a place that I ended up buying the Fukubukuro for. Um, ta -da! I actually have no idea um, about this brand. Uh, I think it's called Scholar, Scholar, whatever. But this Fukubukuro um, is 5,000 yen before tax, 5,400 yen after tax, which is about $50. And it has, I think, four or five items inside and one of which is a jacket. So the reason why I bought this is because there will there are three jackets on display on top of these bags and you can choose which jacket you want in your bag. So I asked the staff um, about the jackets like what is the size? Is it possible to you know choose the size? And um, for the particular jacket that I wanted, they had M and L size and she let me try on the L size and it so I decided, yeah, why not? The other items inside the bag will probably be pretty random. I don't expect them to fit me. Um, so maybe I will, I don't know, give it to friends who may like it. I really like the bag though. Don't you think it's so cute? So yeah, let's let's start and open and let me show you guys what. Okay, so this is the jacket. Ta-da! It is Galaxy Print. Uh, let me open it up so you can see. Which is one of the main reasons why I actually got it. Because I I love Galaxy Print. Um, so this it's it's it looks like this. Um, it, it it looks see it's pretty big. And the best part about this is that the material is actually really quite thin. Um, it is in here. Can you hear it? So it's actually a really thin material, so I can actually wear this back in Singapore as well, which is a big plus for me. Another reason why I didn't really want to buy any Fukubukuro is because they always have like winter coats inside, and I don't need winter coats because we don't have winter in Singapore. The original price is 12,000 yen. Ta-da! Ta-da! See, it fits really nice. I can like zip, I can button it or I can choose not to button it. Yeah! Now let's see what else is in this bag. Second item. Okay, it is, it is a knit top. Um, I just looked at the size and it says M size, which will probably not fit me. <laughs> I might try it on later to see. Uh, I really doubt that it will fit me, but... Oh, look, it has a cat on it! Oh, actually, it looks pretty big. So, I will try it on later, and if it fits me, you will see how it looks like on me. It's green. I don't actually have a lot of clothes that are green, but I'm a Slytherin house, so green is like my inner color, I guess. Woo! Um, this costs... Ooh! The original price for this is 6,000 yen. Wow, this actually costs more than the Fukubukuro itself. Wow. All right, next item. La 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 la. Ooh, what's this? Huh? What is this? What in the world is this? 
What is this? What is this? What? Oh, it's leggings. Okay, it's leggings. Okay. Um, I don't know. Maybe I might be able to fit. It's really stretchy. Who knows? I love stretchy, like rubber bendy stuff because if these fat people like me can wear clothes too. <laughs> um, and the original price for this is 2,900 yen. That is really expensive for leggings. I just buy like my leggings from Uniqlo Heat Tech. <laughs> They're super cheap. Like I wear so much Uniqlo Heat Tech. People say I should just be an ambassador for Uniqlo Heat Tech. <laughs> All right, next item. Whoa, whoa. Okay, what is this? What is this? Whoa. It looks kind of big in the bag. I think it's. Oh, I think it's a two piece. Wow. I have no idea if I can wear this either. Um, let's open it. <laughs> wow, what is this? Oh, it's like a sweater with like a fake um, collar top. It is so cute. This is actually super my style. Like I love stuff like this. Um, and the best part is it looks like you've layered but you're not actually wearing an extra layer inside so it's not super hot. Oh my gosh, I love this. I hope I can fit in. It looks kind of big. Look, it looks big guys. It looks big but you never know because things that look big may not necessarily fit me because I am fully big. But I will try this on later and if it fits, you will see how it looks like. Ah, I'm so excited. I actually, wow, oh, I'm so happy. I think there might be one last, I, I'm not sure. Is there anything else in the bag? Ooh, there is one last thing in the bag. Ooh, it's socks. Well, we can always use more pairs of socks. Yay, sock. Yay, so that was all from, um, da 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 from Sco Sco so so Solar Scholar 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 <laughs> I can't even pronounce the name. I will leave information about the store in the description box below. Um, I will probably also be writing a blog post about it, which I will also link in the description box below. Yay! I'm actually really, really quite happy with all the things that I got. Um, you're so cute! Hey guys, so I just finished trying on the clothes and I'm so happy that they actually fit. I'm super surprised because Usually, I can never fit into any Japanese clothes, so I'm just really, really, really lucky that they're big enough to fit. Like, sometimes if I'm lucky, I get to fit into like the L size, LL size. Yeah, but it's really not a very common thing, so I'm actually really, really pleasantly surprised. I'm really, really happy with what I got too. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> So yeah, I do recommend this brand. They have like really cute clothes. I personally thought they were like a little bit, you know, kind of like the hipster type. I, I, don't, I, really, I don't really know how to explain it. But they're pretty good and the staff was so nice. The service was so good. <sighs> I, I'm just really, really happy about it today. That was my first Fukubukuro purchase, like the first clothing Fukubukuro purchase. And I am so happy with it. Yay! So, I love watching Fukubukuro uh, videos as well. If you have one, if you're buying stuff, or if you have ever wanted to buy, I don't know, what are your thoughts on Fukubukuro? Leave a comment down below! If you have a video, link me to the video I want to go and watch. I just love watching people doing like unboxing, haul videos, Fukubukuro videos. I've been binge watching Fukubukuro videos, which is really bad because I need to go back to do my thesis right now. But, <sighs> but yeah, so hope you liked the video. Don't forget to check the description box for more details of what I got. And um, 
I guess more pictures so yeah I'm super super happy hope all of you have a wonderful fabulous start to 2016 as well this is Bernie you're watching be my life please subscribe I love you all bye